This is why I haven't really decided on any particular one discipline or belief system and embraced it entirely without uh, room for variance and changing one's mind. I've been open to more information, other ideas that may not be uh, conventional or may not be according to certain uh, ac rigid academ academic standards. You know, you have to believe if you're going to be a Jew, you have to be a fully embrace Judaism. Or if you're going to be a Christian, you have to fully embrace all the tenets of Christianity. Well, guess what? There's so many different versions of each of those wands that uh, there's obviously wiggle room for variants of thought and opinion. But uh, here's the thing. I'm glad, kind of glad I haven't really mastered any particular one thing because if you build your whole empire on that one thing, which many do, they have to swear by it and, and pay allegiance to it, and they have to give credence to it with all their might and all their strength and all their mind. And, and, and if they deviate from that, their, their, their little financial world empire comes crumbling down, and they lose their constituents and their supporters and their, you know, hey, you're, you're an apostate, hey, you're a heretic. You know, that's what they were called throughout the centuries, the medieval period and all all the way up from uh, ancient times, even the Roman Empire, even before that. And uh, I don't want to be locked into one particular uh, belief.